This is Sage, owned by Heather and Jared Meyer in Pueblo, Colorado. I'm going to get her out here. A few birds are a little wet this morning. Let's see, hopefully the birds will flush out of this wet grass. Here. So I want to always start her back at my side. Heel. Sit. Okay, okay. Hunt them up. I release her on okay. Hunt them up. Hunt them up. Let's go. Hunt them up. And if she's in, sticking within range, I just kind of leave her alone. Here. There she's getting about 20 yards, so I'll turn her. Okay. Hunt them up. Here. First bird's over in here, so I'm going to kind of bring her crosswind. Hunt them up. First bird's down in here. There. Hunt them up. Kind of got her own little pace to her. There we go. See her turn. A little bit of a. Oh, nope, that bird's not going to get up. It's too wet. Oh, there we go. At least I can get a shot in there. So it did flush enough to get a shot. Usually, if they pop up like that a couple times. Here, good girl. Drop. There you go. Now is they want to start her back at my side. Heel. Sit. Ready? Okay. Okay. Hunt them up. Release her on. Hunt them up again. Yeah, I figured if that bird got that wet, it might not get up at all. But fortunately, we got a little bit of a flush. Next bird's just off here to the left. Here, right, right in there. See her turn on it. Got a little better flush on that one. So the wind's kind of coming across this way. So she winded it, but then she was upwind of it a little bit. Good girl, Sage. Yeah, girl. Here. She's got a nice mouth, comes back really nice. If she won't let go, I just kind of pinch her on her, I call her flank, kind of behind her rib cage. Sit. Ready? Okay, okay, hunt them up. And what I kind of do is I zigzag so these dogs kind of learn to move side to side instead of just going in a straight line. And you guys can see she's got kind of a kind of a pace to her. She's not you know, like running really hard, and where I'm constantly trying to get her checked back in. Next bird's up in here. Hunt him up. See, if she, hopefully it held there so it didn't get too wet. There we go. See her working in on it. She caught that one. Here. Good girl. And I knew that might happen. Drop. I'm going to just toss it. See if it'll fly. Just so I can get a retrieve out of this for you guys. And when the wind's this, or the grass is that wet, that happens sometimes. They just move a little bit. So this is just good for her to get another find out in the cover. Usually their tail wags a lot, and then when they find the bird, it slows down. So she got it right there. Here, that a girl. Good girl, Sage. Good. So here's where I pinch her right there. Well, we got some, at least got some nose work there. Um, we got two flush set. 
the last one you guys saw are caught. And that's going to happen in wet grass with hey, with planted birds. And that's sage, owned by Heather and Jared Meyer, sit in Pueblo, Colorado. Hey. hey.